We often ignore needs in our communities that don't directly affect us. Oftentimes when it's out of sight, it's out of mind. Such was the case for many of us when we found out through our community needs assessment, which we held in the New Jersey Visionary Cyber Legal Club, when we identified hunger as a key issue in our community, even though we didn't think that that issue would affect most people in our country. We learned some surprising facts that one out of eight people in our home state of New Jersey would face food insecurity during the year. And that number grew to one in six when we looked at it from a nationwide perspective. We were galvanized to do something about it just because this was such a prominent issue in our community that many people didn't know about. For many years, we've held traditional food programs and one of our signature projects is one of those programs, hosting an annual Thanksgiving feast for the homeless where we serve over 2,000 hot and prepared meals to those in need. And such was the scene in December 2019, this month, where we held the Together We Can Food Drive and Sculpture Competition. This project brought together people from all over our community and inspired them to fight food insecurity through the power of art. In our club, we're privileged to have so many members that are ex excellent at arts and crafts, and we're so proud of the work that they did. Through this project, we brought together more than 25 teams from all over the area. We brought them together to build sculptures out of the canned and non-perishable food that they brought in. Not only just collecting these donations, but using these sculptures to raise awareness. Through our media partnerships with several media stations, including TV Asia, ITV Gold, Edison TV, and India Life TV, among others, we were able to spread awareness about this key issue in our community. Thanks to the generous support of the Edison Council and the Edison Mayor's Office, we were able to display these sculptures and construct them in the actual council chambers. So much so that one attendee at one of these council meetings, when these sculptures were still displayed, remarked that they were amazed by the amount of food that would be needed by their own town's residents. And I'm here at this uh, very wonderful event that's going on for a food drive for the people that have needs for food during this time of year and throughout the rest of the year. And there's hundreds of people here that are bringing together food for the needy. It is so important that this effort is going on. I see thousands and thousands of, of food here that is astronomical that they actually collected so far from different vendors, independent people, and people who just gave because this is the time of year and it should be all year that we're doing this for people in need. And today is a great event which is called Together We Can. And we have uh, several teams that are creating sculptures that with cans and they did a wonderful job. Uh, there are 20 uh, entries here. You can see oh, tons of cans here. I can't count. And you know, we were judging on the four aspects, the creativity, construction, theme, and so on. And the, the effort that we have here is to bring the awareness for that. We, the cans that we have collected may not feed everybody, but if people understand that there is this need uh, and they do something about it, uh, it, it, that is what our goal is. With these 6,000 pounds of food, we partnered with multiple charities within our community and all over the state of New Jersey, including the Community Food Bank of New Jersey and the Hands for Hope Food Pantry in Edison, New Jersey. On this theme of Together We Can, we wanted to bridge the gaps in our communities. Oftentimes, clubs do very small, individualized projects. But if we thought that if together we did something, we'd be able to have a much larger impact. Partnering with several Lions Clubs, including our own sponsors club, uh, Edison Visionary Lions Club, Old Bridge Visionary Lions Club, Menlo Park Lions Club, and the New Jersey Renaissance Club, and their affiliated Leo Clubs, we amplified our impact and did so much more service than we even thought was possible. We even built community partnerships with organizations like FBLA, the student organization, the NAACP, which is a civic organization, and the Edison Job Corps Center, which is a vocational education center. Through these partnerships, we were grateful to bring together our community to fight hunger together. We even collected water bottles for the canned water crisis in Newark, where lead poisoning was harming the residents and left them without a sustainable water supply. Collecting these bottles and collecting this food was a great step to fighting food insecurity in our nation and in our state. But we can't do it alone. I believe that if we work together, we can fight food insecurity all over the world through the power of Lions and Leos. Because I believe together we can.